how to install the Bluetooth on your computer. So first of all, let's talk about the Bluetooth adapters. They are a small pass device that allows wireless connection between your computer, laptop and other devices like headphones or cables or joysticks and etc. The limits on your mind. So just plug then your computer on the USB port, whatever, and enjoy the convenience of the Bluetooth technology. Because it's that simple, guys. But where exactly do you can find them? So to find the Bluetooth adapters, you can search on online store like Amazon or electronic stores, whatever. So of course, make sure to check the user reviews to find the best products. I will myself put some link in the description below that will be my recommendation. But as always, popular brands include Asus, TP-Link and Avantri. So choose an adapter for good compatibility and range of course. The range is very important here to meet your wireless connection needs. So anyway, like I said, I will leave some links in the description pointing to some options so don't forget to check out. So how to make that work? So basically, you're gonna get the adapter and just plug the Bluetooth adapter into your machine like a USB drive and configure the adapter of course. So for that let's go on menu, we are gonna click and we are gonna write Bluetooth. You are going to choose the Bluetooth another device settings and here you are going to click on added Bluetooth another device. Of course you should already have put the device on your computer. So you're gonna click here, here on add a device you're gonna have two, three options, the wireless display, everything else and the Bluetooth. We're going to choose the first option and here I couldn't connect because it's not connected for me. But for you, you appear a lot of options because you get all the other device that has Bluetooth and it's online. Okay, so you're gonna just choose the one that you want and connect. The second case is a little bit different. Did you know that many modern laptops already have come with Bluetooth built into the motherboard? Yeah, it's true. If your laptop is one of those, all you need to do is install the correct drive to activate the Bluetooth. So first of all, find out the model of your motherboard. You can find this information in the user manual or the manufacturer's website of your computer or even in programs like SPC that will be in the description below it's a very good program I use to see information and temperature of my computer when you open this PC we'll analyze a lot of things like CPU run, motherboards, graphics, storage optical and audio here you can see your CPU, your operation system, right there, and that's very, very, very important because you're gonna have to see your Windows and your bits. So I have Windows 10 Pro 64 bit. That's important. The motherboard is that one. Asus Tech computer, blah 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 blah. For me, it's that one. So what you're going to do is get the motherboard copy go on Google past now like I say the operation system is important so you're gonna you're gonna click to copy past and here on the side we are going to write Bluetooth download my motherboard doesn't have the bluetooth on itself but let's suppose we find one that it has so let's search like bluetooth drive whatever it's just for you guys to see how is the process to download and install so let's suppose that's my drive we are going to download then we are going to open now here on this tab we say welcome to the Intel blah 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 blah. You click next and the process will begin. So click on accept the terms and the license agreement. 
here click on tipco and install after that you just restart your computer and check if it's working that was the video guys thank you for following me until here if that worked for you please leave your comment below if you are not subscribed please subscribe and if it didn't work please leave your comment as well because that way i can see why it didn't work and i can provide other ways for you guys to do and try to make more videos and bring more videos for you guys with another solutions so i'll see you in the next video and bye bye